27th Division personnel of officer rank have entered the command center located at the heart of the base in subterranean level 7. Upon informing military staff headquarters of this, we received a reply saying they'll take action after waiting for an answer from Brigadier General Kusmoto. Taking into consideration that he held an officer's meeting without the knowledge of staff headquarters, it's clear that General Kusmoto is planning on taking some sort of action. Your orders are to apprehend him before he can do so. Furthermore, given that this mission will involve a substantial amount of danger, it has been decided that you will receive special hazard pay. Good luck. Quiet, will you? Hey, can you hear something? Operating under the pretense of reconstructing the far north, the government has continued to favor and finance companies that support Hirama by awarding contracts solely to them. Because of this, in spite of the fact that waste material, a negative legacy, has been left lying around for decades, these shams of public utilities have been forced upon us under the guise of reconstruction assistance with no sense of planning whatsoever. As a result, nature has been destroyed. Our traditions and culture have been perverted, and our souls have been ripped from us. Our leader, General Michiba, was a great man, a man of vision and wisdom. He once said this at a meeting of the Seninkai, Rights and interests are not influenced by ideologies or states, but rather they are simply the usage rights that belong to those who rely on that land for not only their livelihood, but their very survival. You who were born here in the far north and love this land, open your eyes! You can't ignore what Hiruma has done! He has ravaged us without care or remorse! This contemptible parasite has exploited our homeland for his own self-serving purposes! He's trying to turn it into a hotbed of concessions! But we must not allow this to happen! He must be stopped at all costs! This time, we will take back what is ours. We will forcibly wrest the far north from the grasp of our neighboring countries and the mainland, and we shall return this land to those to whom it rightfully belongs. Just a hunch, but judging from the content of that speech, it sounds like General Kusmoto is the one who's planning to assassinate Hiruma. That's not the half of it. After killing him, they're planning to use the memorial parade to launch a coup. Now I'm spilling the coffee. The diversion of weapons was just a sham all along. Everything was being done in preparation for this. Which means a lot of soldiers are in on this. Of course you know what that means then. Kanbei's been fed intel, it's completely backwards. No. Maybe we're the ones who had a plate of bogus intel shoved down our throats. Understood. Before the situation goes beyond the point of no return and can't be stopped, we need to take Kusmoto into custody immediately. However, taking any action here is too dangerous. It would make you a sitting duck. Wait until Kusmodo is alone. That's the time when we'll make our move.
have Kus Mordo in custody. Get yourselves out of there fast and bring him with you. Move it! <laughs> to load Goose Moto inside. We're out of here.
Up ahead is a geofront that the old Russian army haphazardly excavated here. Needless to say, there are no maps. Come up with something and escape from there. Could we maybe use a different escape route, please? There's gonna be damp and dust and little bugs and... I just don't want to go in there! Get over it. We're going in! to hand over Kusmoto. Tell it that if it wants him, it can damn well try to take him. Stains. I don't see how it's possible, but there's a chance that the little girl who was with the Black Touch coma was flesh and blood, not a prosthetic body. Don't jump to any conclusions. We'll run a component analysis, so bring that blood back here. Roger.
Yes, we made it out safely this time. But in the future, I request that you choose a more suitable work environment. We'll get you fixed up good as new once we get back to the hangar. So quit your griping. Can I even do a structural analysis? It's awfully quiet. Yeah, it sure is. Funny, I figured they'd be on a much higher security alert than this. While you were underground, things have taken a sudden turn for the worse. I'll fill you in on the details later. For now, bring Kusmodo with you and rendezvous with us. Roger. A group of soldiers assigned to the 5th Army 27th Division's Command HQ are rising up in revolt, primarily within Berutarube city limits. However, it looks like the majority of the soldiers aren't sympathetic to the group's ideology, but instead are being controlled by a virus. Ishikawa. I've got an update for you about that virus. Remember the virus that Tommy had planted in the maid robot? From what I can determine, one that looks exactly like it has been planted in the soldiers of the 27th Division. There's no way to know for sure how they were infected, but I can make an educated guess. More than likely, the virus got into them via their data link system. We went through defense ministry channels so we could tranquilize the soldiers. Then we slipped them the vaccine we'd worked up before all this happened. Then the people running wild in Berutaru Bay right now are the real thing. Well, I guess we'll have to pump them full of lead, not vaccine, huh? That's fine with me. What I'd like to know is how this situation managed to get so far without being made public. The answer is Conde. His JSDA watchdog outfit is supposed to provide a check on the military, but they shirked their duties. No, more than that. They kept releasing false information. Of course they wouldn't report a planned rebellion to the top brass. Isn't that right, General Kusumoto? Look at him grin. There's no point in asking him, Major. Let's just check his cyber brain and get this over with. There's no need to go to all that trouble. I have nothing to hide any longer. I'll gladly cooperate and tell you everything. Get one thing straight. Your little rebellion effectively ended the moment we took you, the ringleader, into custody. True enough. However, I expect that at least now our debts will be settled. Hiruma, huh? You know, I just don't get it. Why do you have to be so hung up on Hirama? Before the Far North was handed back, he worked with Russia to buy up all the land that they expected would be developed. Hirama then split with Russia the land usage fees from the companies that he lured in. General Michiba had gathered evidence that would prove this conclusively, but the Public Security Agency back then caught wind of the Sanin Kai. The Public Security operative who was assigned here back then was Kanbe. Although Kanbei approached General Michiba as a public security operative, he sympathized with our ideals and became one of us. When he learned through Kanbei that the Sanin Kai was the target of JSDA watch surveillance, he chose the continued survival of the Sanin Kai over executing Hiruma as a criminal. To avoid further pursuit by public security, General Michiba allowed himself to be charged so that the head, not the tail, of the organization would be cut off. So the reason Section 9's information was leaked. It wasn't us in the military that Kanbei was keeping under observation. It was Section 9. Apprehend Kanbei at once. Put all public security affiliated personnel in the far north under house arrest. Chief, he gave us the slip. He somehow dodged the Section 9 surveillance net and escaped. Contact the support police and have them take Hiroma into protective custody on the double. Roger. We don't have time to think things over. Head for the urban district.